guys welcome and welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be on spring makeup spring summer you can see with my flowy clothing and yeah and i hope you guys gonna enjoy this video so to see how i got this look this bold beautiful look stay tuned and keep on watching I'm going to use my estee lauder day we met to moisturize my face i'm going to use this as the primer as well i'm not going to apply any primer because this moisturizer is it's it's really nice it helps um smooth out my face and it also minimizes my pores as well it doesn't specify that but that's how i see it when i apply it on it's really nice so i will do my eyebrows off camera so I'm ready to um, prime my eyes and I'm going to go with this rose gold palette from Beauty Treats. It's uh, really nice. This is how it looks inside as well. And I'm going to go with this pink shade as my transitioning color. So I'm going to use this uh, eyeshadow, it's also from uh, Beauty Treats, it's Modern Mate, 12 shade. And then I'm going to use this shade right here, this orange shade. I'm just going to focus on my crease area. I'm just going to blend it all out again. Blend, 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 blend. You must always just blend it out and don't forget to tap. And then I'm going to use this red shade, this one here. on my creasing area again just to emphasize and you know make it more saturated and blend and I'm going to try this uh, new product that I got from MAC it's new to me it's a shade vintage uh, selection it's paint pot it's from mag so i'm trying it for the first time pant pot and i'm just uh, going to use my finger to put it on this primer just makes your eyeshadow last longer and also enhances it to pop out and for my red color, I'm going to use my lipstick from L'Oreal Paris. It's in the color Forgive My Sin. Blend it with the rest of the shadow. You just want to keep it very low because you're going to because you're going to um blend it out and you're going to move it upward as you're blending it out so
because it's a lipstick, it's getting messy. But I'm gonna fix it. So I'm gonna go with my uh, just normal brown pencil to just um, you know. Smoke it out. I don't want to use a dark pencil. It's not going to make it look nice. I'm just underlining my waterline. Next, for my face, I'm going to use... I'm going to mix those two together. So I'm mixing my Double Wear Estee Lauder and L'Oreal to Laura Paris True Color. The True Color is in the shade Cappuccino 8N and my Estee Lauder is 5C1 Chestnut. to me when I apply it alone. And I'm going to use my Real Technique brush. I've noticed that I get a full coverage when I use a brush than a beauty sponge because beauty sponge ten, tends to um, not give me a full coverage so I really like using a using a, a brush rather than a sponge. To conceal my face, I'm going with Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 30. Highlight my face. My mustache. Mustache. Yeah. I don't. I don't like to put concealer on my face because it makes me really super oily. So you guys, I literally damp my mirror as well, so it's so misty. <laughs> 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 Work it inside. I'm gonna use this from L'Oreal Paris. It is Sculpt Stick, shade 240. I really have a humongous big forehead. So and I'm just using uh this brush that I got from uh, Miss Signature. I think it was about seventy nine. I can't remember the price, but I got it from Miss Signature to just blend out my contour. And I'm just using uh, my the sponge that I used earlier on to just blend it out and just smooth it all out. And then my foundation brush to just uh, blend everything again. To set my face, I'm going with uh, Maybelline Master Fix Setting Powder to set my face. Ugh. 
Oh, I love this powder. It's just so amazing. It's so smooth. I'm going to my powder brush from Mel Technique and I'm blend it all out. Blend, 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 blend. Blend, 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 blend it all out. So I'm going to use this for my as my false lashes and I'm also going to do my eyeliner off camera because it takes a lot of time to do it. So I did my lashes off camera and now I'm, before I apply my lipstick I just want to apply my blush which I forgot. To blush I'm going with this uh, blush from MAC. Look at my family. <laughs> Uh, it's in the shade uh, Love Thing. It's a mineralized blush. And I'm using my Roll Technique Pro Color Brush from Mac. Highlight from Miss Signature. Just lightly to highlight. I'm going with this smudge gel lip liner. It's 01B7 from Clicks. Smudge. And for my lipstick, I'm going to use this Maybelline Tantalizing Top 725. And then I'm going to use this lip gloss from Essence. So I'm going to use the setting spray from MAC to uh, set my makeup and I'm just going to spray it all over my face and I'm also going to use like a plus sign to make sure that it gets on my T-zone area. I'm going to go just fix my hair and change my clothing and I'm going to come right. Ta-da! So this is, I just went to do my hair and I changed my clothing because I'm never out with my man. Um, yeah, there you go. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you're gonna go and try it, please tag me on my Instagram account and my Twitter account and I'm gonna put the link down below. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos, add to my YouTube channels and please share my videos. But please you guys help my channel grow and I appreciate those people that watch this and, and shares with others. Thank you so much guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.